Oh man, are we doing it? I think we are! Hey there everyone, this is Aokao playing Rakugaki Mario. It is a uh, pretty recent this year ROM hack inspired by, of all things, VIP2. A community ROM hack just out of sheer, let's just build a thing, put it together and see what happens and I don't know. Like, I, I heard the spiel, I read it, and I was excited for a ROM hack that I haven't been in a while. And so here we are, I'm gonna be playing it. That's basically what it amounts to. The game I heard gets pretty difficult, and at some point I might start using save states. I'm just putting that out there right then, right now. Was then he heard the princess calling. Not only is this an old style hack, but they went as far as to only use like older tools. There's actually a version out there. Well, one, there's a Japanese version. Two, there's a version out there that's purposefully made just like with the old system that don't do anything. And but what by which I mean like you can't play it on the console and there's basically no quality of life and whatnot. But this one though, I'm playing the version that is console compatible so I can play with an emulator that makes sense and all that. Boy, here we go, it's the horse sign. Uh, I have to, all right, wait, one at a time. It's just one at a time though. That's okay, well you know what, good for you. <laughs> all right, let's just go. Like a Kuhai Mountain. I believe the game starts pretty easy, but you know, it builds up and things happen. And, um, wow, is it framey for anyone else here? I don't know, maybe it's just this place? Maybe my settings are not what they could be, mind you. Alright, let's just go. Charlie is right here. No, yeah, like, there's something that bothers me a lot. About the way the scroll, it doesn't feel right. I don't know, it just could be this level. Anyway, here's the place where the lands are brown. Oh, and a guy kicks a thing. And that guy's got baseball that he can throw. It happens to the best of us. I just kind of stood there and stood there underneath that plant. No one understands why. All right, here we go. I can try and enter pipes. See, sometimes you enter a pipe and you end up in a magical world of spines falling. And see, magical world of just a gray platform is there. That's my favorite kind. Magical world of coin. Oh shoot! Well, all right. You know what? I found a secret exit. <laughs> so it's just that one pipe you find. I got hurt, but it's okay because I unhurt myself by virtue of a mushroom. All right, are we gonna see the big map? We sure are. Let's take a peek. There's islands here in a big circle for you. Big piece of brown island on the corner. Here's a wood. That's where we're gonna be going. All right, well, here we go. Let's do the level for real. All right, so this is the level, and this is where it is for real. Ah, <laughs> uh, I will say though, this game just feels all right. But again, it's just something feels weird about the scrolling and the way that it is affecting me. Yeah, there you go. You can just kind of do that, right? Oh, shoot. All right, I didn't get the midpoint. I will surely rue this day. I, wow, the baseball is kind of going on forever here. Having fun, moving along. Pipe just on the edge of town. So I got this from the still, at the time when I downloaded this was in the still pending area of the Smooth Central. I don't know where it's at now. Uh, I figured, but not, and there's a link to the less finished, like less compatible version. That guy's got a little baseball house. A house to just do his baseball on his own. Oh shoot, uh, uh, and there we go. First death. There we go. I even didn't get the <laughs> Whoa. Okay. I did that. I changed the setting. I don't know if the scrolling will feel more good better after that. Is there something... I think it maybe is. Maybe I'm just not used to this. Like, it's also just real and it's all in my head. It's possible. I don't know.
did it. I got the thing. Whoa. And I didn't fall in the hole. I did all that. Thanks to money! I, I, I've been here. Where did I die? I completely forgot the method of my death. This is a complete mystery. I remember you. I remember here. Oh, I missed that one up. Those are like brick bricks. They're like Mario 3 bricks. You can't just spin them around and hope for the best. Alright, maybe you want me to make a bridge there? I don't know. Yeah, it looks like it. Money even appeared to everyone. Look at that, we're back at five. We're back at five lives. It's like it never happened. Check it out! It's Mario! We're in the level. We do some hops, and there's mountains in the backyard, so you gotta be careful. Ba ba Kuhai Mountain. These are all. You know, it's the mountain of the Kuhai. Oh, or, oh yeah, the yellow switch palace. I should probably do that. Maybe that would be a good idea. Let's check it out. The switch where the yellow is paliced. Uh, you give me a piece switch and a whole bunch of locomotives. Uh, all right, well, here's all the money that you can use to invest in lives and doing a kind of bad job about it. <laughs> Hey, there's a one-up up here, though, right here on the shelf. It's the one-up shelf. Uh, everyone's got one of those in their Switch palaces. Uh, do you think there's any here? I mean, if I was smart, what something you could do is just die of old age in here, and then come back. I'm not gonna do that. That seems like bad flavor of beans. But... Oh... oh. Okay. Well, it looks like the game will do it for me. Dying of botany rather than lethargy. Truly choosing our space in the world. I got got though. Well, you know what? I still get one up profit, kind of ish, maybe. That's right. So, yeah, I mean, I feel like that's the strat then. You just die all the time and you still accumulate lies, but I'm clearly not doing that. Pow! There we go. Now this game will be very easy. But there's like no arrow, there's no into the. Like, I don't know. You just show me dotted lines and you show me a square. What am I supposed to do with that? Start family, eat anchovies. Help me out here. All right, let's do one more. See what happens at the playground. Uh, check it out. It's boxes. I can bop them and get my thing. I don't got like any like credit levels or anything on this playground. We got monkey bars. We got bomba bars. We get we got free arrows. Country. More importantly, we get an early cave that I can get at any point I want in the future. Right here, right now, blue pipe, know how, slide down, angry guy, I saved myself, I don't know how. If you don't have a Greenland, well, that's most people. Most people do not own Greenland. It come as a shock. <laughs> it was quite a shock when I learned that, that's for sure. But I want, yeah, I want good power-ups. See, here I am with mushroom in my box. Like some kind of mushroom haver. Whoa, edge of the bush. That's right. It's right there on the on the edge. That's the pool. It's the playground pool. Then you bounce on things and you don't know why. And you wonder where the time has come. Slowly down the slide thing. Yeah, that's right. Blue thing. So, I don't know if there is a red switch palace in the game. Well, there's probably a red switch palace in the, in the game. But, like, available? Do I want to go down there and then down? That seems, like, ludicrously dangerous. But, I do have a cave I can use. So maybe we can get... Yeah! Maybe you can just kind of slide down the thing by accident. Oh, you gain nothing from this. I guess you avoid a bomb. Look, if the bomb bomb is very scary, you know what? I get it. I'm not gonna judge. Hey, bonus zone. Alright, so this is a place where you got blue coins. Don't worry about it. There's a muncher. I lost my thing. Oh, shoot. Uh, yeah, don't just stand on a muncher. 
Yeah, Muncher is not the playground. It is the person that lives at the playground. It keeps chewing very loudly some kind of food you are not able to identify due to the limited reach of your personal cultural bubble. And that is how we do the Mario occasionally. It happens. Okay. It's here. This very, very good feeling just kind of swooshing through my body. It's here. Okay, I'm excited. We got an intro to World 1. Next time, like, I'm just, maybe it's gonna be like a level in the water and a castle, three levels. So maybe next time we end World 1, I don't know. I don't know anything about not knowing anything. There's nothing you can do about that.